Speaking of robots and AI, our very own Mike Davis is at CES. Uh, Mike, you're hanging with the robot this morning. Craig, is, does this one give you toilet paper? <laughs> <laughs> no, Jason, no toilet paper, but listen, the Jetsons are basically coming to life. We're here at CES. I think we're at the coolest booth you could be at at CES. I'm here with Jeff Gordon, the director of PR for UB Tech. Jeff, the robots are coming into the family home life sooner than we think. When can families expect robots to be in the home? That's right, so this is our Walker robot and it's still in development right now, but uh, we believe this is gonna be coming into your home sooner rather than later, really the not too distant future. What is sooner rather than later? Is that 20 years, is that 10 years, is it two years, what is that? It, it's definitely not gonna be 10, 20, 50 years in the future. Uh, we don't have an exact date just yet, we're just showing off this prototype here at CES, but, uh, but really in a, a shorter amount of time than you would expect. And you guys are going to be doing some demonstrations here. We're going to see one in a second, but you guys have been here for three years and you keep making improvements on the Walker robot. Can you tell us a little bit about those improvements? That's right. Uh, you know, robotics are incredibly difficult technologies and all the artificial intelligence in it. So every year we've been incrementally building on top of the technology. The first year that we brought Walker to CES in 2018, it didn't yet have arms. Last year we brought it here and added the arms and hands, the, the ability to uh, grasp and manipulate objects. Yeah. And this year we've really focused on the software inside its brains, the artificial intelligence, in order to give it smoother motion controls, more environmental awareness, and, and so forth. So talk a little bit about that impact that once a Walker robot comes into the home, I mean, what can families really expect? What's that impact gonna look like? So Walker is absolutely a, a service robot in the home, and so we expect it to be able to help out with anything and everything that you might need, uh, whether that's carrying heavy objects in the home, uh, going up and down stairs in order to do some cleaning perhaps, uh, maybe even just when you're sitting on the couch and you want to get a drink, Walker will open up their fridge and bring you that drink. Wow. Okay, so right now we're going to see one of the coolest demos I think anybody at home is ever going to see. We're going to try a Coca-Cola, shall we? I think that's a great idea. Prepared by Walker. <laughs> that's right. Walker, can I please have a Coke? So what you're seeing here is Walker has 36 servo motors. The servo motors are basically uh, what causes it to make all of its movements and be able to grasp and manipulate objects. And this year we've developed new visual servoing technology. That visual servoing allows it to uh, open the bottle cap on the Coke. And then this is very, very important, uh, be able to pour the bottle of Coke into the glass, even if the glass were to move slightly. Walker can use its artificial intelligence to adjust the trajectory of its pour and not pour anything on the floor. For you and me as humans, that sounds pretty trivial, yeah. but for a robot and artificial intelligence, it's actually an incredible feat of engineering. Oh my God. Well. I am going to try this Coke prepared by Walker, and usually I'm an ice guy with my Coke. I'm betting this is going to be the best Coke I ever had in my life. This is remarkable. All right, let's see. All right, I'm going to grab this. Thank you, Walker. Look at this, guys. That is the best Coke I ever had. Wow. Guys, back to you in the studio. We're sticking around. We're going to hang out with Walker some more. That's the best Coke I ever had. That's, uh, that, that is amazing. Um, don't complain about the ice. I don't know if um, Walker's are capable of, you know, fixing it for you or, or if you want a diet, like a diet Coke or something. Jason, who cares about the ice? That who was cares? remarkable. We're sticking around. Guess what? We're doing yoga next oh, with Walker. Okay. Oh, cool. Okay. All right, Mike. We'll check yeah. back with you then. Thanks.